Prince Charles will take up his duty to the throne because his eldest son, Prince William, doesn't want to become king before his father, a leading royal author has claimed. Gil Pet said the Duke of Cambridge has no desire to take the reins early, despite a shock survey revealing almost half of Britons want the 35-year-old to become the next monarch after Queen Elizabeth rather than his father, Charles. The Prince of Wales is said to be desperate to become King of the United Kingdom and has spent his whole life preparing for the role. Writing in Charles, Prince of Wales, Ms. Pet said, Prince William does not wish to take the throne early. Although, like his father, William will be destined to have a far shorter reign than his grandmother, he has said he has no desire to climb the ladder of kingship before his time. Ms. Pet also insisted Charles would eventually capture the hearts and minds of the UK public. She said, the Queen's quiet dignity and grace won her a place in the hearts of the British people long ago. Without doubt, when the time comes our new king will serve with a strength of character that will continue to see our royal family the envy of the world. When that will be is for God alone to know. But Prince Charles will not become king early and succession to the throne will occur naturally, according to Ms. Nappet. She wrote, The Queen has never favoured abdication, as a young girl she experienced the life-changing effect on her immediate family when in 1936 her uncle, King Edward VIII, gave up his sovereignty to marry divorcee Wallace Simpson. Edward's abdication changed the course of history when he stepped down from the throne to marry the woman he loved, pushing his brother, Elizabeth's father King George V, into the spotlight which eventually led her to become the Queen. And on her 21st birthday, Elizabeth II, the world's longest reigning living monarch, pledged to serve the country for her whole life. Ms. Pet added, Princess Elizabeth's parents had to take on roles they neither expected nor wanted, that of King and Queen, and the ten-year-old princess became first to the line of throne. Her fundamental sense of duty is expressed in the pledge she made on her 21st birthday when in a broadcast to the Commonwealth and Empire, she said, I declare before you all that my whole life whether it be long or short shall be devoted to your service and the service of our great imperial family to which we all belong.